New tonight at 10, we're in touch with members of the Oakwood University's Aeolian Choir involved in a bus crash yesterday in California. Students and faculty that made the trip are waiting word on when they can travel back home from San Francisco. Some of their identifications burned when their charter bus was involved in a fiery wreck. Oakwood school leaders have notified TSA and police. They're waiting to get approval so all 44 members can return home to Huntsville at the same time. School leaders hope to fly out tomorrow or Tuesday. It's been a hectic and scary weekend for members of the Aeolian Choir. And tonight, we're going to be hearing from the pastor of the San Francisco Church, who is calling this weekend triumph over tragedy. This choir represents the best, and we want to share that with the Bay Area. As you can see from what's left of this chartered bus, the Aeolians choir's trip to San Francisco didn't go as planned. A car smashed into the back of our bus, uh, flinging us from our seats. My glasses flew off, uh, uh, everybody's glasses flew off their face that wore glasses, it was crazy. Um, phones, people flying everywhere. Soon after the crash, a fire started, and the choir members had to abandon everything on the bus and flee. It was a miracle that we were alive. Uh, shaking up, kind of hurt. My neck is killing me right now, but um, we're blessed to be alive. All of the choir members' belongings and performance outfits were consumed in the fire. People in the Bay Area heard about the accident and came to the rescue, paying for new fitted suits for every guy in the choir. We're just so happy that somebody out there uh, believes in helping out their neighbor. The Reverend at the church in San Francisco where the choir is performing. We shall says these choir members are more than singers. They won Choir of the World in Wales back in 2017 and placed in the top position in uh, for World Choir in South Africa this past year. So they're indeed a World Choir. 